Uh, <coughs> fuck, again, dude. this is brought to you by Bespoke Post, <sighs> the gayest subscription masculinity service. <laughs> I used to hate when I was on Instagram. I fucking hated those those ads. Those ads. Mm-hmm. That company more than anything. Yeah, they send you like you pay fifty dollars a month. You get like a jigger. Yeah, you get like yeah. things a compass and like a $7. copy. Of, yeah, just like a leather bound copy of mm. like Hemingway's short story. Right, 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 right. To read at twenty eight years old, <laughs> I'm into reading now. A fucking pocket watch. You know what? I am into reading now. Yeah, I started reading again. F- yeah. Now you're copying me. No, I, I was started, reading first. I started before you. No chance. I read Huckleberry Finn. I never read it. I know it's for kids. But I feel like it's Mark Twain's great, dude. It's really good. Yeah, you know what? You know it might Twain. be one of the only books that I've lol. You know who I have the confidence to say you know is what great I, that people up. don't like is Dickens. Really, Dickens is great. Oh, you have the confidence to say I Dickens have the is good. I have dude, the you really <laughs> went there, dude. I do. <laughs> And because you deal with this kind of this kind of this, <laughs> no, this if you had just said Dickens was great, I'd be like, okay, no. cool. But you're, well, you, you said you have the confidence. You have to, to say deal he's with great. this yeah. <laughs> to be a part of the Dickens. That's community. what happens. That <laughs> you have to deal with this. That's what happens. I don't care anymore. <laughs> <laughs> and Nick's rich. Yeah. I have the best of Dick. I have the worst of Dick. Yeah, yeah. that's some good Dick. Pills. That's me on Dick pills and without Dick pills. Dude, that book. That book is awesome. I'm sure the whole it's moral good. of the thing is like you think bitches be on some shit, but really they're trash. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, and it's all about the homies. Any moral no, where the it's not. He, are he sacrifices bad. himself and for for, for no pussy, pussy. for no, no pussy. pussy. Yeah, no, but then he sacrifices himself there? for for a bitch bit that he's in love with, but he looks exactly like her her man's, and his ma- her man's was supposed to get executed, and he does it as a gesture of love for her. What? But he gets no pussy. What? Yeah. Oh, sorry. I was thinking of Great Expectations. No, that's Tale of Two Cities. That's Tale Tale of Two Cities. That's it's what hard the fuck break. happens in that book. Yeah, that's yeah, what yeah, happens. Yeah, yeah. What the yeah. fuck? Yeah, well, you know, you know, Great Expectations. How that book ends, right? No. So the book starts off, and the little boy, like he's just playing around his house, and some like fucking Scottish prisoner, or some like groundskeeper Willie dude, like walks by with shackles on, and he's like, "Have you lot pick?" And mm-hmm. the little boy like gives him like something out of the shed, and he like takes the shackles off. And then it's like, you know, him growing up and then he like ends up wandering onto some like like dilapidated estate. And there's this old creepy old woman that lives there with this young girl. And the the old woman's like mean to the boy. Mm-hmm. But he also at the same time, like through the the old woman has this like, I guess, executor or lawyer or whatever that like handles the estate that also tells the little boy like there's a mysterious benefactor who's like giving you like money to learn how to be like proper. Mm. So he gets like clothes and he thinks that it's the old woman like turning him into like a man that's worthy of this young mm-hmm. girl so that she can like right the wrongs of her own life or when you know because like a man left her so she's making him right. a proper woman and then he'll eventually get pussy from the young girl of course doesn't happen turns out she is just a bitch that hates men and was like manipulating this little boy the entire time wow and teaching the woman to be you know manipulative and kind and it was just like the scottish convict like went and made a shit ton of money and was like sending money to the boy to freedom Wow! So it's like it's about the fellas. So it was free money. Yeah, and but the bitch told him there were stipulations. There, the bitch was not giving him money at all. Wow. No, he got it from the convict. From the convict. Yeah. Inch. Oh, I remember reading Tale of Two yeah. Cities though in high school. That convict's being, a good guy. And yeah, being no. heartbroken. <laughs> yeah. I remember getting to the end and being like, "Hell yeah, <laughs> yeah, that guy." Because you think it's a movie about a book about a cuck. Right, because it feels like that, a which guy, it is. A guy trying it, to get pussy but so the moral much. Moral of the story is that fellows look out for each other. And you know what? He gave him so much stuff. He could have bought cool clothes. Yeah. Could have bought uh, like guns, and he could have bought pussy. You ever read? And up, he wouldn't have had to do any of this. You ever read up, he wouldn't have had to fucking jump through. And he wouldn't have had to learn any lessons. <laughs> no, he could have bought pussy and gotten <laughs> fucked up. Yeah, <laughs> that would have been such a but much better have, life. They didn't have like Ferraris or nightclubs back then. Yeah, yeah what would what would you? They spend didn't have bottle on? service. Nothing. You would just have money. You have like gold and shit. Gold. All right. No, you got a castle. You could dress cool. You could probably get a carriage. You ever read of human a bondage? sick horse, sick carriage. a sick horse, a couple What's that? sick horses. Of human bondage. No, it's a book about a cock. Also, I saw my kind of tea, cup of tea. I know it's a very annoying book. I hate shit like that. I like shit that's like. I read a book about uh, the fuck did I just read? Fuck, what was it called? I read this book. I was going through a thread of. Uh, I asked people for book recommendations like six months ago. Yeah. And I went through the thread and picked stuff with a cool 
cup. Like if anybody mm. posted a picture and the cover was cool, like had a bitch on it. So I read titties. this book called Hyperion. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's Is about, it about the fuck? bridge in Los Angeles. No, it's about like some fucking monster that like. It was the first. It was two books. The first one was interesting, and then it's all about time travel and shit. And it was kind of mm. got fucking confusing. But you should read Huck Finn, dude. It's mad fun. No, I'm reading. It's a, really good. I'm reading a Confederacy of Dunces, dude. That's the only other book that I've lol. It's fucking at. hilarious. It's the funniest book of all that time. That book fucking rules, dude, dude. You should play that role. Dude. I know. I saw the that's picture the, of the guy. I was like, the, that yeah. is the role. Well, there's like a. I, I'm not sure. But if he's this too is, big. He's, he's like, I'm not sure if this is huge. true, but apparently every time they've tried to make a movie. The, guy the actor has died. John Candy was going to do yeah, it. Yeah, it was John Candy. John Candy would have been perfect. That's yeah. still, I still think, the funniest name of all time. John it really a is. A fat guy named Jonathan <laughs> Candy. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. Yeah. yeah. Very Dickensian, right? Yeah. Mm. What's yeah, that, what's that called? No, nominative, de- nominative determinative? Something like that. <coughs> yeah. I well, should change my name to Stavros Gets Pussy. Yeah. yeah. And you guys should both be Adam and Nick sucks mm-hmm. dick. Adam is respected. <laughs> no, no, no. Mm-hmm. Adam and Adam Nick B- sucks dick. Adam B- you guys respect- are brothers. <laughs> we both share that name. The sucks dick boys. <laughs> <laughs> the sucks dick boys. We solve mysteries. Adam and Nick the sucks dick boys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you solve mysteries. You just suck everyone's dick for you know clues. The, you know the sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Encyclopedia gay. Encyclopedia <laughs> homosexual. Mm-hmm. Encyclopedia Downs And he's like Somebody took the cookies From the cookie jar <laughs> <laughs> Who did it And it at the end of the book me. He's like It was me yeah. <laughs> wow. The entire town It was town an inside job All lives in the mind Of the retard Oh it's like that movie Identity Oh I was thinking Pelican Bay Or whatever the fuck Pelican Brief No 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 Something Bay no, there's a TV show. Where no, no, no. It's it's a Scorsese movie. You're thinking of Quantico. The no, FBI with show. Leonardo oh, DiCaprio. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Quantico. No, <laughs> what the fuck is that called? NCIS Miami. <laughs> fuck, dude. He's on an island, Shutter Island. Norman said one time, he's like, NCIS, what's that, CSI for black people? <laughs> 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 That's a good one. That's a good one. <laughs> good on Norman for that one. Uh, yeah, yeah, that one was Shout good. Shout out to Norman. <laughs> 